Hello everybody, today we'll continue off our series of converting various formats to PDF. Today we are looking to convert HTML files to PDF. And to do that, we're going to take advantage of another Python package called PDF Kit, which is basically a wrapper for work HTML to PDF. So the first thing we want to do is we want to install WKHTML to PDF. And one of the easiest ways to do that is if you just come here to the link I have provided here, I'll put it in the description down below as well. You just click one of the download links, follow the installer steps, and it'll download the package in the correct location. One other option I do want to provide as well is if you have a package manager, for example, like Homebrew, you can also just do brew install, work HTML to PDF, and in this case, I already have it installed, so it's telling me to reinstall, but you can do it that way as well too. So once we have that installed in the background, then we're going to install PDF Kit. So to do that, it'll also just be simple as doing pip install PDF Kit. This should take about a minute. I already have it downloaded, so it's not too much of an issue. And once we have that installed, both the Python package and the work HTML to PDF library, we can go ahead and start implementing our code. So I'll keep the functions from before, the convert PDF, which takes a PDF and converts it into images, convert images, which takes images and converts them into PDF. Now let's make another function. We'll call it def convert HTML to PDF. And in this one, we're gonna take two particular parameters and it's going to be HTML page and save name. Now before we can start implementing our function, let's just import in PDF to kit. And then we can just simply do PDF kit dot from URL. We pass in our HTML page and our save name. And this will automatically convert out our past HTML page to the save name. So for example, if our HTML name was google.com and our save name was out.pdf, it would take the HTML page from google.com and convert it to a PDF called out.pdf. There are a couple other options as well here. For example, if we do PDF kit, and we can see there's from file or from string. The from file is another popular option if let's just say you have a static HTML file you have downloaded and you want to convert that to a PDF. This will be the great option for that. But for this demonstration, we're just going to simply do PDF kit from URL. So let's now call our function convert HTML to PDF. So let's pass in our HTML page. In this case, for a demonstration, we're just going to use google.com. So https forward slash dot google.com. And then for our save name, let's just call it google.pdf. Now let's run our file. And now we can see over here that it was loading pages, counting them, resolving the link, loading headers and footers, printing the pages. So basically it was parsing the web page we had provided, converted it to an HTML file, converted that HTML file to the now PDF file. And if we open google.pdf, that got produced right now, we can see the Google homepage. So just to go over what we've done so far today, we have downloaded the work HTML to PDF library, and then we have downloaded the Python package PDF kit, which is just a wrapper for that library. And then from there, we simply just call from URL if we're passing in a URL and a save name to get our URL as a PDF. We can also pass in a static HTML page. And then from there, we can do from file instead of doing from, from URL. And this helps us convert various HTML formats to their PDF counterparts. So hopefully you guys found that helpful and educational. If you did, please consider liking and subscribing. Uh, and see you guys.